Hallo Leute und willkommen zurück bei Let's Play The Wolf Among Us. Episode 4 ist endlich da. Beim letzten Mal ist einiges passiert. Wir haben gegen Ende der letzten Episode Bloody Mary kennengelernt. Und ich bin sehr gespannt, wie es jetzt weitergeht und wünsche euch viel Spaß. Can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. Crane must have taken a shard with him. The open arms. Enjoy your stay. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. Bigby? How could you do this to me? I guess I finally see you for who you are! Tell me who did it! Just tell me who did it! I know you know! I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? Take him, okay? Take Crane. Well, this is a, a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. Out with the old, in with the new. Long live the queen. sind also wieder zurück im Apartment. Oha. Wow. See around. Hollow point bullets are a nasty business. The silver slug deformed and shredded on impact. He'll be okay, though. Hmm? He'll be okay? His internal organs are positively riddled. Oh, If das I don't sieht nicht gut aus. single scrap of silver, he's liable to suffer some long-term toxicosis. Easy there. Try not to move. Ugh. <lacht> <lacht> We can't keep needing this way, old boy. I figured I'd be done before Oh God, what's with me passiert? What I can do for the pain? What? What happened to me? There was. You got lucky, and found yourself in the care of a most skillful surgeon, me. Please, Big B, don't move it, doctor. Look, I'm a bit engaged, saving his life at the moment. But if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. Oh, was? Uh. Uh. Das ist nicht schön. Colin ist auch da. Toll. Oh mein Gott. Na, ja, das geht ja schon sehr gut los hier. Und nochmal drücken. Oh Gott, wie krass ist das bitte? Oh Gott. Wow. Na, da haut sie lieber ab. Not bad. That'll do, I suppose. He's lucky to be alive. And he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. He didn't listen to me before. Maybe he'll listen to you. I don't know about that. Well, he should. There are limits to what even I can do. It's not like I... Ask for this shit to happen. Yes, but it's not like you actively discouraged it either. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes to finish with him. I, I think I should stay, at least until he's out of the woods. Believe me, Bigby couldn't be in better hands, and I need the space to work, so if you wouldn't mind. Don't worry, Snow. I'll be okay. 
Ach, die beiden sind ja irgendwie süß, ne? Zusammen. Ja, es ist wahrscheinlich besser, wenn sie geht. Hey Doc, how much longer? Colin, leave him be. It's finished when it's finished. Because I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in 10 minutes flat. <lacht> Colin, Alter. you're not even supposed to be here right now. Oh really? Where am I supposed to be? <lacht> I'm here to take care of my friend. Could you please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open? Yes, that would be helpful. <lacht> Ach, der Colin, ey. Ah, there, all done. Oh, Gott sei Dank. Great. This isn't a habit you should keep to, having visits with me. And, well, this time, this time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Miss Watt. Das ist ja noch mal gut gegangen. You'll be fine for light duty, if he can figure out what that means. He knows what it means. It's just been an unusual couple of days. I know, but please, don't give him the excuse. His body will eventually give out. Take care of him, please. I will. He'll need rest, I assume. Sleep mostly. Just keep watch. And make ich sure bin he doesn't get into further altercations. I'm right here, guys. Come on. Anyways, guard against, as they say. Miss White? Sheriff? Colin? Swiney? Ich mag ja den Colin irgendwie. Ich finde es schön, dass wir ihn jetzt wiedersehen. Erstmal ein Bier, genau. So, how do you um, feel? It's Big B Snow. He'll be okay. Hell, Mach dir keine Sorgen. Don't worry about me, alright? I'll be fine. See, strong as an oak, this guy. You had us. <coughs> you had us worried there for a while. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or, or died, I guess. It, um, it kind of scared the hell out of me. Oh man, it took me so light. Like that. And when Swinehart arrived, you know him, he's never worried. And even he thought you were... Snow, I'd never leave you. Aww. Yeah, you were really fucked up, man. You look like when you take an action figure and bend its limbs the wrong way. Colin... I'm just saying I was worried about him is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, I'll get some rest when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? What's even happening out there? I mean, do you guys have like a plan or something? And who should I be asking? Should I be worried about the crooked man taking over? I miss Crane or is Crane still the thing? Crane is still our focus. I just can't forget everything he's done. I don't care if he has problems with the crooked man. Ichapod's gone. It's over for him. He's not coming back. It's not about Crane anymore, Bigby. The crooked man came out of the shadows for a reason. For him to attack us so blatantly like that. He either feels invincible or desperate. Well, if those are my two options, I don't think I'd pick desperate. What do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying, that's not exactly something you do when you're playing with house money. So he called my bluff. It's not like I'm gonna let Bloody Mary just murder him. Yeah, uh, thanks, Snow, for all that back there. No problem. Thanks? You're not pissed that Crane's flown the coop? Or that the crooked man thinks he's got snow under his thumb? Du warst nicht da. Mad about it, Colin. Snow hat getan, It's was sie like konnte. A strong choice in the matter. What else could Snow do? If she didn't hand him over, my ass would be down the witching well. And Crane still would have been taken. Okay, okay, I'll take your word for it. All I care about right now is just what does the crooked man want out of this? I thought he was just a loan shark, but clearly he's operating in other circles. It can't just be about Crane, right? Getting him out of town? Is this all about the murders? 
Crane can't be useful to him anymore. So what could this have to do with Faith and Lily? Sie haben sich mit den Falschen angelegt, falsche Feinde. You know, I couldn't really give a shit what they want out of this. They just made the wrong fucking enemy. <lacht> Remember what Swinehart said, okay? Ja, ist ja gut. The Crooked Man declared war against us last night. At least that's what I thought when it happened. But now I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. We need to do things the right way. What does that mean, the right way? What do you think I mean? I don't know, but it suspiciously sounds like your Was way. Du? Wir tun unser Big Bestes. the one on the front lines. Ich kann nur mein you can't give him a leash. He doesn't work that way. Yeah, wait, what do you mean? What is this right way? We haven't been doing a good job. You and I. So, starting now, we do everything cut and dried. By the book, straight as an arrow. Pure as driven snow. I'm not saying I'm the arbiter of... Sure you're not. This town has enough monsters. What happened last night, what you turned into, it can't happen again. We need monsters. The yeah, sie hat ja recht. Colin, if I really believed that we needed him to lose his flippin' mind at a moment's notice... I'll do better. We'll do better. We have to be better than them, or what's the point? Right, exactly. Thank you. Look. I'm sorry that I have to bring all this up, but I think it's important. Look, Bigby, I care about how this is done just as much as I care about it getting done. So for that, you want to give him a handicap? Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Everybody wants Bigby to smile and shave and take a shower now and then. Hell, I'm practically the president of the Bigby. Don't be such I mean, a good no good, but... I can speak for myself, okay? He'll get the job done. Just let him do it. I'm going to... I'm going to let you do it, okay? It's just that... Now that I'm deputy mayor, I need your respect. And this situation has to end. What situation? All unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay at the farm. Oh, give me a fucking break. Oh, huh? Are you gonna let her talk to me like that? It's been the rule for a reason, Colin. Oh, ha, come on, winter. Look, everyone just calm down, all right? I'm perfectly calm. I'm not. Tell me right now, what's it gonna be, baby? Wolf's residence. That's rude. Oh, Buffkin, <laughs> what is it? Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? Nerissa. Nerissa? Oh, the main Frau. Yes. Apparently, she told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about. Oh. But that she'll only tell you. Okay. What do you think that could be? Uh, Bigby's got an admirer. You always do well with the Sie weiß irgendwas. disenfranchised. Something about your prickly demeanor attracts him like a moth to a flame. She knows something. She's helped me a little with the case. Maybe she has something else. Maybe she does. I should get back to the business office. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. And I should probably change out of these clothes. Consider the discussion tabled, but not over. Let me know when you're done with Nerissa. Aye, aye, Captain. She's a piece of work. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? Nein. I mean, she seemed real serious about it, but I can still hang out here, right? Look, uh, maybe a few will get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. I wouldn't do that to you. Oh. Thanks, Bigby. Oh, ich hoffe, er wird's auch früher oder später nicht tun müssen. Was war das denn? Das sah aus wie ein Schuh, wie dieses Schuh-Town. Aber das ist ja nicht unbedingt ein Märchen, ne?